Kawasaki. The name means one thing, high performance. Here they come, four new KLT three-wheelers for 1984. Tough, dependable, and fast. Red Hot Kawasaki's for work or play. We've got the KLT 200, KLT 110, KLT 250 Prairie, and the all-out weapon of the three-wheel world, the Kawasaki KXT 250 Takata. If you want maximum performance, this is it. The Takata is a racer, the fastest there is, and winner of the USA Off-Road National Championship first time out. It's also a play bike, just waiting to give you more fun than you can imagine. The Takati is named for a tough little border town in Baja, where the off-road races would break a Sherman tank, but not KXT's. Watch this. They're rock solid, and they run hard all day. One reason is liquid cooling. Heat robs horsepower, so the machine with liquid cooling maintains peak power far longer than the machine without it. The Takati's 250cc two-stroke engine comes straight off the motocross track, where it's been proven tough and fast in motorcycle competition. Same with the Unitrack rear suspension. Eight inches of bump-soaking travel. Up front, there's motorcycle-type forks and a taller tire for better bite in the turns. A disc brake delivers strong stopping power, and you control the power with a five-speed gearbox and manual clutch. Control and power. That's Ducati, built to beat everything else on the track or in the rough. Imagine how much fun you can have, shooting for a new personal best, racing for fun against your buddies. The Ducati does it all. Mud, water, fire roads, sand, hill climbs, dry lake sliding, and pro-class racing. It's the fastest thing on three wheels. And if you ride one, so are you. On a farm or ranch, Kawasaki three-wheelers and accessories can help with dozens of chores. And KLTs make your work a lot more fun. Here's the 250 Prairie, rigged with an optional Kawasaki sprayer that covers an orchard in record time. You can ride a lot of fence line on a Prairie, and it easily carries all the wire and tools you need for repairs. When you're ready to go again, the engine restarts instantly with the push of a button. The heavy-duty rear rack carries a big payload. Smaller items go on the front rack. The engine works hard for you year after year, and dual shock front suspension glides over bumps so the ride is controlled and comfortable. The Prairie bulls through Louisiana swamps like a gator, thanks to Kawasaki's exclusive dual-mode differential. You can lock the rear wheels for maximum traction, or with the quick turn of a knob, make the tires spin independently for easier steering and minimal soil damage. Don't worry about horsepower, the Prairie has plenty. Here it rescues a stranded tractor three times its size. The chains go on, he climbs aboard and you're both ready. With a manual clutch, you feed in just the right amount of power to get the big tractor rolling. Then the KLT's engine takes over, the biggest engine in any utility three-wheeler. 250 cc's of Kawasaki muscle. When all the chores are done, the Prairie is ready to play, just like you. Here's the KLT 110, new for 84 and sized especially for moms and kids. It's got standard tires, but a smaller chassis, so it's big and little at the same time. Kids don't outgrow it, and moms don't have to ride all scrunched up on a kiddie bike. Size isn't the only stroke of genius on the 110. There's a five-speed transmission with a special automatic clutch. Just hit the heel-toe shifter and go. The engine was designed for a three-wheeler from the ground up and easily outperforms every other machine in the class. A father and son can tame this rocky wash no problem. The KLT 110 brings Kawasaki three-wheeled fun to the whole family. 
And now, the most versatile of all three-wheelers, the KLT 200, for work, or play, or both. A new rider can master the controls quickly, and an experienced rider will appreciate the fully enclosed O-ring chain, electric starting, and five-speed transmission with manual clutch. Of course, the 200 has front suspension and a dual-mode differential. Let's dress the 200 with Kawasaki accessories. Here's the rear rack, which easily carries a Kawasaki generator. A water jug fits perfectly on the front rack. Hunters mount a rifle on the padded gun carrier and ride through tough terrain directly to the game. With a trailer, you can carry several hundred pounds, and the KLT's four-stroke engine doesn't even shrug. The 1980s cowboy herds cattle with a KLT. He can fit his Prairie or 200 with floorboards, mud flaps, special tires. Kawasaki has whatever accessories it takes to do the job. Remember, whatever KLT you choose is bred by Kawasaki, the king of high performance. <laughs>